What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor, DVDJ, and use code your boy Bugs for 10% off at checkout. And yeah, man, check them out. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today... We are going to go over some market talk, as you guys know. Um, we're going to pretty much talk about the market. And before we get into the video, make sure to drop a like. Let's get 110 videos on this. Uh, let's get 110 likes on this video for a chance of you guys winning 20,000 MT, like a ton of you winning 20,000 MT. Or maybe I'll just do 100,000 uh, MT giveaway on Twitter. So make sure to follow my Twitter down below. And before we get into the video, let's run this ad. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit sportstmb.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. And yeah, so we got a lot to talk about in this market because honestly, I'm thinking Friday we got March Madness. So we'll, we'll, we'll talk about that as we go on. If you guys don't know, man, the market is rising a lot. So if you didn't sell most of your cards, I uh, would probably recommend selling your cards. It's only players that are dropping are obviously Kyrie and Larry Bird. They're probably going to end up dropping a lot more. I think Bird is going to be really cheap sooner or later because his pink diamond is actually really similar. And I really don't think it's worth the upgrade. As you can see, I, I am sitting on 1 million MT because I did sell my Kareem for 580k, I believe it was. And I got him for 380 so huge w i sold them when there was literally three on the market i waited late night saw there was three on the market was freaking out and yeah so some guys you should be doing so if you guys don't have your mt racked up i would obviously recommend selling your team like i said it's too much but with the market this high like i'm gonna just show you one thing that caught my eye and made me go like what tracy mcgrady for 640 bro what this car was around freaking 380 or no, maybe like 440, like three days ago. Whenever they had the content, what was it? When they had the market update, so Friday. What was that? Three days ago, four days ago? About four days ago, this car was four something. He's went up 200,000 MT. So not only that, um, not Larry Bird. I'm trying to think. What are some carts? Uh, we got Bosch went up a lot. Zion went up a lot. Pretty much every single card in the game went up. We're pretty much just going to go over prices. And honestly, bro, right now the Amethyst filter is still the best filter in the game. And it's honestly proven in my 10 minutes night video. You did not check that out. This filter is so goaded as of late. And if you guys want to... Oh, 1900 for Purvis? Nah. If you guys also... some Something, if you guys got banned... You have free 10 packs. If you got banned accidentally, you have a free 10 packs in your unopened packs. So if you guys did get banned, make sure to go check those out. Because if you get those packs and you pull some fire, that will be huge. Supposedly, it's a 10 box of buzzer beaters. That will be sick. I wish I got banned because <laughs> it sounds crazy. But I wish I got banned for no reason, even though I wouldn't get banned for no reason. I clearly promote MT and it's kind of scary. But other than the facts, right now, man... I just got to snipe real quick, 1,000 MT, real quick on this market cheese. Um, about to make 700 MT in one second. But that's not the point. So I just want to show you guys that how much the Galaxy Obos have rose and why you guys should sell now. So Vince Carter's up, KD's up. D Rose actually around the same price. He didn't really go up that much. But this is my point. So we haven't had a market crash in a really long time. And honestly... It's March Madness. I mean, there is no March Madness being played, but they always drop a March Madness promo. If they don't drop a March Madness promo, what's 2K without a March Madness promo? So I think a March Madness promo obviously is coming. I just said that a lot, by the way. Um, since I do think it is coming, I'm expecting a giant market crash Friday. And with Shaq going for around 150, LeBron going for around 350, freaking Giannis going back up to like five something... I really just think it's really good time to sell. And honestly, I'm just going to go over some snipe filters I've been using while all this stuff is going on. And please, like, this is the team I'm rocking with. It's still really good, obviously. But it's not as good as, like, some other players. But I don't know. I don't even know anymore. All I'm saying is, 
if you want to sell your team like i told you to buy like a nice little diamond budget squad like take like 200k or whatever you have like 100k buy lonzo get some tokens up get Embiid, get a bunch of budget players bro get george mercine get michael beasley whatever you could do because honestly if you're rocking with a god squad a galaxy Bowl squad there's no point right now because there's a market crash coming and you're going to be able to make a ton of mt with these tips i'm about to show you so first off if you want to make mt the fastest and you don't want to have a headache this is my favorite filter in the game i pretty much say this in every video because bro enough said this is the best filter in 2k it's the fastest the quickest the most simplest it's money and the cards sell quick and you saw my 10 minute snipe challenge after a while bro they start pouring in that's a snipe he goes for around 3k another k made right there so we just got joan b for 1900 he's around 3k another thousand mt made there so this is honestly really interesting oh ah uh, no also whoever invested in amethyst paul pierce yesterday diamond paul pierce yesterday they actually went up in price a lot like for instance amethyst paul pierce was rocking around i believe like eight seven k he's going for around 12 ish k so if you do invest at locker code packs the right time you could make a ton of mt of locker code packs like literally whatever 2k drops you just want to pay attention to what drops off in the market so you can stack up on them uh this one's old i literally just saw that one i literally just bought that one so pretty much every time you see like a market crash you see the market die you see crazy packs come out you could pretty much hop on this filter and get a snipe every refresh that's what i do that's why i have so much mt and also obviously i have so much mt off investing if you guys want to invest it's pretty simple you pretty much look at what cards are in packs like for instance aaron baines was like 1200 the other day he's rocking around 2500 so if you picked up 100 make a thousand mt of clean off him per card if you got a hundred of them, that's a hundred K. You sold them all. You made over a hundred thousand MT off one card. So that's pretty fire. Not only that, bro, if you do end up buying, like, I got lucky with Kareem. I got him for 380,000 MT and I sold them for 580 when there's four cards. Like, for instance, I did it with Curry too because Buzzer Beater cards are really, really rare and you just gotta know when to buy them. If you could find out where to buy them at the right time, you could make thousands of and thousands of mt if you really just wait like you just gotta be patient you know so honestly filter amethyst obviously is good another filter i'm going to show you is strictly diamonds because dude they're just so simple you don't have to stress if you miss a snipe because honestly they're not huge snipes i mean i did miss muhammad abdul Raul for around 5k that was a huge l I don't like how Armand Rose cheap again. He he pisses me off. Like if they if I see one more Paul Pierce locker code or one more Armand Rose locker code, I will honestly freak out. I probably might quit this game because I cannot see them in one more locker code. They are the biggest trolls ever. But yeah, yesterday on this builder, my snipe builder video, I missed a freaking Muhammad Abdul for 500 MT. Don't know how. I thought I was super quick. But yeah, this game doesn't really like me. So what am I gonna do? But let me think. Honestly, if we do have March Madness promo coming, we have a huge market crash coming. Like I said, bro, we have a market crash, like a really big one, about once a month. And for all you guys say that the market doesn't crash every week, it kind of does. But you got to pay attention to what cards drop and what cards go up. Like, you really do got to pay attention because there's obviously strategies on ways to make MT. Obviously, the way when I show you strategies, sometimes they're a little delayed Considering the fact that I posted or I made the video an hour later and then right when I drop it, whoever saw it first is going to get my MT methods the best way and the quickest way. That's just another tip for you guys. So like if I'm posting and you see a noti bell, bro, turn on the noti bells because honestly when my MT methods do get, um, when they get leaked out, bro, like for instance, bit, oh, that's a snipe. I missed it. Oh, that's a snipe, right? Oh, wow. Okay. That's a fat L. I literally just hopped off at the filter the worst time. But yeah, that's really all I got for the video, honestly. Um, I obviously hope you guys did enjoy. Like, make sure to snipe. Make sure to sell your cards. Please sell your cards. Stuff's probably coming tomorrow or Friday. Whatever. We shall see. Anyways, though, I hope you guys did enjoy. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. We missed that, too. <laughs> Alrighty. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more content. Peace.